According to SISD policy, students who have negative meal balances can't walk the stage at graduation or participate in end-of-year activities like field trips and field day. A few weeks ago, that was about 850 students. They may get behind for whatever reason, and of course we want our kids to participate and be involved in the school. It does pile up very quickly, so in having friends, it's kind of a little bit daunting to think about stuff like that. Difficult times or maybe um, uh, different circumstances come up we got to make sure that they get fed and fed well. Jason Shilley owns Covenant Roofing in Sherman. When he heard about the number of unpaid meal balances and the way it will affect the students, he knew he wanted to help. I really was just looking for a way that we could have an impact in the community and have such a direct influence on so many students. So he donated $8,500 Monday, the exact amount the school needed to cover all of those meals. These students tell us this donation means several of their friends will now be able to walk the stage. Having the benefit of those fees being paid off, I think is um, a wonderful way to give back to us. And did something will enact meaningful change, not just, you know, 10, 15 years down the road, but immediately. Improving the lives of people, taking their, taking their fears away from this. Take that stress or whatever they have to go through off their shoulders and allow the kids to get the maximum benefit out of being in school. You're coming up on the end of the school year. Let them have fun and be able to do all the things that they should be able to do. In Sherman, Abby Maynard, News 12.